Cakes Wins for Kansas. Brought to you by Devon James Injury Lawyers. Watching the wounds that never fully heal. Imagine a place where on Thursday mornings, veterans can retreat to for a safe space to talk about healing and moving past the trauma of their service. In this week's Wins for Kansas, we go to a spot in West Wichita where the bond is forever. Ashley King did not serve in the military, but it touches every aspect of her life. My husband served in Iraq and Afghanistan in the Air Force for 10 years and struggles with PTSD and lots of other things um, that he will live with for the rest of his life. There are the wounds that people can see wrapped in a sling or a cast or impacting the way somebody strides. But these wounds are even deeper than that can even be lifelong. My grandfather that recently passed away, he also served in Vietnam in the Navy, and I watched him struggle also through the rest of his life from service. Inside Nameless Coffee at Ridge and Maple in West Wichita, veterans, active military, their families, loved ones can meet up every Thursday at 0900 hours to talk, a place where the unspoken can fill the silence. It changes absolutely everything about their life. Um, it changes absolutely everything about the way that they see the world and events and relationships and things. Um, our whole family lives with my husband's PTSD. With a formal program that's coming up and a book that serves as a guideline. We're working on starting Reboot Combat Trauma Recovery. Um, it's a 12-week course that really focuses on military combat trauma and the effects of that and healing that. King tells us each book costs about 20 to $25, but there's never a charge for the people who walk in the door and want to talk about those 12 weeks that can change a lifetime. The Devon James Injury Lawyer is here with our friends from Sojourners who honor service members and veterans. We love what you're doing and we're excited to contribute. Thank you to Devon James and Cake for partnering with us to help military and service members and veterans in our community. And to the men I met with back on Thursday morning, thanks for having me. Thanks for telling me your stories. To nominate a nonprofit group for Wins for Kansas, go to cake.com and click on the 